Liverpool! We are here in the middle of a residential area in Liverpool, but somehow there's also one of the most legendary football stadiums in history right behind us, Anfield Road, guys. Today I'm here with Felix. What's up, guys? We are two Germans and it is our first ever Premier League game, right? You haven't seen a Premier League game in your life? Not live, no. So let's see what we can expect. Some people say Anfield atmosphere is one of the best in the world. Some people even say it is the best in the world. And others say it is very overrated and the fans are not good at all. Well, I guess we'll have to check out ourselves. Today it's also not any game. It is pretty much the biggest game in English football, right? Right now, Liverpool FC against Manchester City. Look at the houses. This could literally be in some random German village in our region, but it is right in front of Anfield. All right, guys, now this is the cop, the legendary stand. And then right in the corner here, that's the main stand. Two minutes ago, we were in a calm living area with every house looking the same. And now we pass one street and there's a thousands of fans. The location of the stadium to me is very, very random. You do not expect a football stadium, especially not a football stadium of this size and status in this area. There's a live show here. I don't know if they do this every game, but you can tell it is a massive game today. Bob Paisley Memorial here, guys, and the Champions Wall, 19 league titles, six times European Cup, Champions League, eight FA Cups, three UEFA Cups, nine League Cups, and so on and so on. What a football club. <laughs> stadium food, fries, and a Coke. Well, I have to say I prefer the German curry balls and the stadium beer. W, this is our entrance right here. That was easy, guys. We're already in, but I almost didn't fit into the gate there. How small is that? That's actually crazy. I feel like I'm walking the Burj Khalifa. This is so high. I don't know how many... Ah, I think we're here. I think we're here. Yes. This is looking good. I think this area inside the stadium looks way nicer than in most German stadiums. It's not as dirty as in German stadiums. It's very, very clean. You have the beers. I am impressed so far. Let's go. First time seeing the Anfield pitch. Guys, that is high. This is fucking high. Wow. Wow, man. Well, this is our seats. And look at this view here. Couldn't get any better. Anfield Road, main stand. Look at this roof, guys. Very, very, very low. And this is what many people say is the reason for Anfield's crazy atmosphere. The roof basically amplifies the sound and the shouts from the fans. Very, very, very unique here. Let's see. And I just spotted that over here is where they are increasing the Anfield capacity. I think to like 61,000 or something. And that's this stand here that will be upgraded. And we almost didn't spot the away end. I think it's this section here of the Man City fans. Now that we are at our seats let's give our predictions i think unlike what most people say man city will not crush liverpool the anti atmosphere is going to give them the push 2-2 i'm going for a draw this time felix what do you say predictions for the game well i'm hoping for a liverpool win so i will say 2-1 so you think 2-1 or you hope 2-1 i hope 2-1 i mean it's basically the game between the most successful english football club of all time and the current best english football club it can only be a banger <laughs> So apparently they just say hey after every player while in Germany we just shout the player's surname. The players are arriving here. Do you see this man right here? Let's just hope he doesn't tear Liverpool apart today. Oh guys. Thanks for the tickets. But they do celebrate every single action in a very, very long manner. Crazy. Liverpool fans saying, Where's the European Cup to Man City fans? <laughs> 
That's when they get loud. Wow! Look at this guy. They get extremely loud in these situations when something happens. And gonna run. Oh. First actual chance of the game. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Best chance of the game so far. Oh, heading Arland. Ooh, man. Oh, so they are getting more and more chances now. Wow, what a tackle on Phil Foden there. Oh, this would get dangerous now. De Bruyne, Haaland, oh, that was a sweet combination, but Alisson is still there. And it is half time, lads. And basically everyone seems to be getting some beers or whatever, but so many people leave their seats at half time. I find it so random that you can literally see the street and the cars here. Second half, guys! And I will give you my honest review on the fans later, and I have to say, we made some really, really interesting observations here. On the questions... Whoa! On the question if Liverpool fans are overrated or not. Now Liverpool with the counter. Yeah! Yeah! Salah right through the in front of the goal. Yeah! Come on, Salah! No! No fucking way! How did you miss that? There was even Kyogo Jota or Bobby or someone else who we could have passed to and he misses that. On FIFA we call this a sweaty, easy sweaty goal. A second later, City score. That always pays back when you miss a goal like that. A minute later, they score. Oh, VAR. VAR. We're getting a VAR check here. Oh, he checks it. He checks it. All right, checking for a possible foul before the goal. And they cancelled the goal. There was a foul before the City goal. And the Liverpool fans are loving it. Where are you now? Where are you now? And Liverpool, yeah, yeah, yeah! Oh! Crazy scene right now! This game is becoming crazy! Back and forth, back and forth. And now that the game is heating up, the stadium is heating up too. That's what I mean. Wow. Almost all up. Yeah, yeah, nice! Bobby tried to do the Haaland. It didn't quite work out. Oh no, Haaland. Oh! What a save. Yes! Very, very good save from Alisson. Haaland yet to score, and it's been 63 minutes. Oh! 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 Yay! Another one! Oh, Salah, so unlucky today. Yeah! Yeah! Mo! 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 Now Anfield is exploding against the seemingly unbeatable citizens. Liverpool 1, City 0, nada, niente, null. And in these moments, Anfield gets insanely loud. It is beautiful. And another one, another one, Darwin. Oh, Darwin Nunes. Let's fucking go! Now it's getting dark with the lights on here. I think that's even more iconic automatically. The next chance for Liverpool there. Oh, hey! WWE shit. <laughs> I think it was Thiago on Rodri. Red card for Jurgen Klopp. Oh my god. Klopp, oh, what did you do? He's fuming, he's furious. I have no idea what he said. And this fan is an absolute legend here. Six minutes of extra time. Darwin, come on. Pass the ball. Oh, oh that could have been the 
seconds. Why the hell do these people leave three minutes before the end of the game? I don't get it. Sorry. Why do you go to football games if you do that? Well, Liverpool are doing it very well. They are keeping City out of their third. So City aren't even creating any chance right now. But I don't want to jinx it. I do not want to jinx it. Nope. Whoa. Bro, blow the fucking whistle. When is it going to end? Game over. Heritage. Look at how happy this guy is. Wow. Incredible scenes. Guys, one hell of an experience. First Premier League game for the two of us. And we watch a game like that. First loss for City of the whole season. It's almost historical because they seemed unbeatable. Liverpool fans freaking out. Hall of Anfield exploding. Bro, how did you find the atmosphere? It was honestly pretty overwhelming. At yeah. first, I didn't really get it, you know. It was pretty calm at parts, but in the end, especially in the second half, it was amazing. Yeah. Some people literally told me, yeah, yo, bro, enjoy Anfield, the library. I get where they're coming from, but I really think they're totally exaggerating. But the thing is, English fans, I think overall, are a bit different to Germans and the main difference is first of all German fans are yeah, up the reds, mate. In Germany, you always have that sort of minimum level of noise, right? Whilst you clearly saw there were situations, and in the first half, Felix said it, a lot of situations where the stadium was literally really, really silent, and you could hear your own voice even if you talked silently. And that never happens in Germany. So there we were a little bit surprised, and I think this is also why some people say Anfield a library, but obviously that is totally exaggerated. You have these silent situations, yes, but whenever something good happens, a tackle, a ball recovery, a chance, the stadium goes goes absolutely mental and then it's even louder I would say than in most German stadiums so you have the extremes I wouldn't say they are better than German fans they're different once again thanks so much to Sorare for sorting these tickets Sorare new sponsor of Liverpool FC you also and as always guys let me know what stadium experience you want me to visit and rate next and I'll catch you in the next one